So here we are. The average cost of a wedding dress can set you back £1,385. Now considering that the average salary is £27,600, that's 77% of your monthly paycheck. Instead, many brides-to-be are opting to buy their dresses from department stores, known as off-the-right dress shopping. James Bride offers a range of bespoke, made-to-measure wedding dresses for women in Nottingham, and the owner warns ladies against bagging that bargain on the high street. Well, obviously, if you buy something off the rack, it's, you haven't planned in advance, and usually it's something that you've got to compromise on. Uh, because of the availability, you may not be able to get it in time for your wedding if you've left it too late. So if you uh, plan well in advance and, and have a nice look round and have those special days out with your family and friends, then that makes it all more special. And if you're buying off the rack, then you, you're putting yourself under unnecessary pressure. And what's this dress called? This is an Ian Stewart dress. He's a British designer, award winning. And each of his designs are created, each one individually. And the designs are well structured, they're beautifully made uses the best laces and fabrics. Georgia, out of 10, how would you rate this one? This is the low one. It's the low one. <laughs> it's the low one. It always has been that special purchase, that one special dress. And with a flurry of marriage proposals expected for this coming Tuesday, it's probably time to start saving. This is Anthony Sinclair for The 6.30 Show.